Greetings from the World Health Organization on World Blood Donor Day. I thank the many thousands of you who are holding events. More importantly, I thank the many millions of blood donors around the world who freely offer this gift of life. In high-income countries, transfusion is most commonly used for trauma, cancer therapy, and heart and transplant surgery. The situation elsewhere is more basic. In low- and middle-income countries, most blood is for the management of complications of pregnancy and childbirth and the treatment of severe childhood anemia. Too many people are still dying because they lack timely access to blood and blood products. This is a huge and unacceptable tragedy. WHO will continue to assist in the strengthening of national blood systems so that all people in need have access to safe blood and blood products. WHO has long stressed the use of voluntary unpaid donors as the safest source of blood. We have some good news today. Some 60 countries now receive almost 100% of their blood from voluntary donations. This is a most welcome trend. But we need to do more. WHO's goal is for all countries to obtain 100% of their blood from voluntary donations by 2020. On this World Blood Donor Day, let us vow to work together to reach this goal. Thank you.